Hello and welcome to the channel and welcome today to Layers of Fear. This game is out on Steam so you can go pick this up for yourself right now. It's been out for a little while but I've just been sent code over so we're going to check it out. Some of you may know if you've been on the channel for a while that the last horror game that I played was Amnesia and I quit very early on because I am a wetter. So I'm pretty bad when it comes to horror games. I, I'm alright with horror films, horror films don't bother me, but horror games freak the hell out of me because it's all sound. Hence why I've got my headphones on for once. So, we're going to try this out. I'm going to start from a brand new game, so we can see a little bit what's going on. I've got subtitles on and stuff, so you should be able to see and hear. Um, yeah. I'm going to be honest, I am breaking it. So let's just, let's just start. And I'm going to hope. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Hmm. <clears throat> right. Quick little bit of information. You play as a painter who is trying to finish his magnum opus. It's a sort of Victorian-styled... Mm, psychedelic-esque horror experience. So it's mostly like an exploration sort of game. There's no necessary danger that I know of. But, yeah. Okay, so there's quite a lot of artwork in this and quite a lot of famous artwork, so if you're an art fanatic, there's probably going to be a lot of stuff in here for you. So I will probably take time looking at pictures just because it seems like that's a pretty major theme of the game. It's not very nice, is it? Okay. Now, let's put our big boy shoes on. Let's go. Now, the one thing I did find cool is whenever you like click, you then have to use the mouse and like pull it away, so it actually feels like you're interacting with things a lot more. So, like, to open this chest, you have to, like, click down, then I have to, like, slowly lift the mouse. Which I quite like that. Uh, press space so you can read it a bit easier. Okay. I'll try not to spend too much time noting through that. I just want to open it so that if you're the sort of person that wants to read these so you can get a good feeling for the game, then you can. So this is more for your benefit than for mine. Because... I kind of want to get through this as fast as I can. To my knowledge, I've been told this game isn't actually that long. It's a couple of hours long, so probably as long as you'd want it to be. I don't know if there's any benefit to opening all these, but I'm going to anyway. It's definitely not. Some dominoes and stuff. It looks, looks like general cupboards. You can really open a lot in this. Uh, keys are in the office. Have a nice day. Okay, so we need to go and get that. <coughs> okay. Right. You hear like a clock. Oh, it's the grandfather clock. I could hear a clock ticking. It seems really strange to me to have my. Because usually I only have my headphones on if I'm like gaming just by myself. So all of a sudden recording and also hearing all these extra sounds is kind of strange. It's like a dog collar here or something. Can't bring that up. What? Pop cool? Pop cool? I think. Oh well. Okay. Ooh. Um. Uh. Feed you beautiful night. Made the tree view. Let's go see you, beat. <clears throat> okay. Nothing particularly amazing around here. Let's try and head where we're probably supposed to be going. I feel if I need to go and get a key from an office, I need to be going upstairs. Is it? Well, we can kind of see ourselves a little bit. If we really. Hmm. Okay. Oh. That's better. Now we might be able to see ourselves a bit. Mm. Hang on, is that like a... 
Is that a two-way glass? Or is there a light drip? There's like a light behind it. Oh, that... No, I'm not a fan. Fuck that. Oh, no, not a fan. Fuck that. I'm out. I hate the idea of two-way glass. Two-way glass. No. We have a very small man there. Okay. Oh, good God. That's a grid and a half you wouldn't want to see. Horrible pictures. This music is strange. Is that blood or what the hell is that? I ain't going over there, fuck that noise. What the fuck was that? This looks like my office. I don't trust anything. I really do not trust anything. <sighs> okay. More more light the better. This is my understanding. I don't know if that's actually true, but there you go. Uh Okay. There's the key, we need that. Uh Okay, so it looks like we have a bit of a drink problem from the same note. Oh, that's cool, you have to drag those. That's some very nice little red riding hood stuff there. So we've got a few smash bottles, a few other bottles around. Quite a lot of bottles around, actually. So there's some nice detail in some of these models that you pick up. Kind of loses it a little bit here, but like... On the main shaft of it, it's pretty cool. Anyway, <laughs> stop, stop, stop procrastinating. I'm putting off the inevitable. Let's carry on. Okay, white door or door with the horrible marks in it? I already know the answer. Oh, hang on, what we got here? Oh, try again. Been working all night. Oh, God, the goosebumps just went up me then, because the music stopped. Oh, something's going to leap at the bed at me, isn't it? Oh, no, music's freaking me out. Keeps stopping, and now we're back to the piano music. Ooh, I don't like this. Oh. Sort of sapphire ring or something like that. Hmm. Why did you start and then stop? Oh, another note there. Just pause it if I if these close too quickly or whatever you need to do. Sorry, I'm sort of skim reading them at best. Um, okay, there's nothing particularly. Oh yeah, bastard! I open these things fully expecting that stuff to happen. Then when it does happen, I still give it a little. Ugh. Let's just look at pictures of dogs. Much nicer. Yeah. I get the feeling something is telling me to stop playing the piano. <sighs> Fine. Oh, it's locked. Okay, well, that's a shame. Oh, well. What a terrible shame we can't through that way. But that means I have to go through this door, which could have been the door that creaked open. Goosebumps just come straight up my back. Oh, that's locked. It's almost like the only place I can go. 
is a child's room. Oh, the music stopped again. Okay. Creepy ass dolls. Oh, I'm stuck on that. A toy soldier. Okay. I need to remember to breathe. Breathing helps. Okay. That's still locked and we need the key. We've already gone through the office. We've already checked all the rooms up there and that's locked. So... Yes, we have to go and see if there's anything down here. Oh yeah, of course we got the key for the main. Don't be doing that. Come on. Oh, that click got you. Hmm. There's a lot of the same pictures dotted around. All the music. That's a lot of bottles. <sighs> okay, we know it's coming. Lost. It. You deserve. Holy damn. Just a few there. <laughs> oh, it's locked. Okay. Uh. Okay, I was expecting... Something's gonna. Have... That was a big lobby before. There is goosebumps gone straight up my spine. And now it's going all blurry. Come on. Come on. Brave. We're brave. It's just a game. You know it's doing that thing where I think that I can lean around walls. This should be what this is like these games I always think this is where VR will triumph. I hate the fact that certain doors will slam shut behind you. Just out of reach. It's gonna be a jump scare, it's gonna be a jump scare. Just out of Fuck me. Yeah, that's the that's the fucking image you want when you just had that happen. Curtains. No, I don't wanna do it. What the fuck's going on here? Hello? Oh, I don't fucking like this. Going in circles. Not intentionally. Scraps of love. So is that meant to be like our wife playing the piano there? Okay. Damn it! 
it still slams shut. I'm sorry that I'm not talking a lot. I'm, I'm trying to just be immersed. Because I feel like that's what I need to do for horror games. The fuck's that noise? Right, we need to find a code. That doesn't really give much away. Is there a code somewhere? Can we see any form of code? Right, but now we've been locked in here. So, we need to figure out... Uh, what the hell was that noise? I'm, he I'm hearing things, I'm playing tricks on myself. I don't know if that's whispering or what, but that is breaking the fuck out of me. <sighs> Nothing in there. <sighs> nope. Ah. No. No. There needs to be a number. I'm just going to be guessing forever if I don't know what that is. Where the fuck is it? I'm missing something really obvious, aren't I? Um, not really seeing anything at all. I don't know. Oh. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Amazingly, I was nearly right. Eight, five, four. Okay. Eight. Five, four. Okay. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Never forget. So that must have been the past holds back look closer. I mean I can't see anything on there that's gonna lead us to anything that much more. Okay, come on, we can do a little bit more. Hmm. No music. Oh goody. Uh, okay, come on. A little bit more. We can do just a little bit more. Why are you rocking? That's not a normal thing to do with no one sitting on it. Okay. I've done that weird misty shit again. What the fuck is going on there? Nope. It does go misty as you walk in. It's kind of strange. And... No, I can't get back out. Okay. There's the creepy music. The fire looks a bit strange. I don't want to go near the fire. 
And I don't really want to go near the doll. I don't particularly like that either. But there we go. Okay. What the fuck? Did I just fall through the floor? I can't see a fucking thing. Oh my god, I can barely see that. See a note there. Come on, we can do. We can get a bit further today. I can't see a damn thing, so if they jump scare me now, I'm gonna be pissed. You fucking git. What the fuck? No, 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 no. Fuck that, fuck that, fuck that. I'm not turning back fucking range. I know exactly where this is going. No, fuck this. Okay. We're brave. We're brave. Okay. Let's talk more about the game. This game was in early access for some time. I think it came out 15th of February, I want to say. Down the rabid hole. I don't know the fact you've used the word rabid there instead of rabbit. Secret passages. Classic Victorian horror. We're back into this room. Wait a minute. No. Wait a minute. That was a baby before. And now it's not a baby. It's the picture that tried to kill me. Fuck you. Uh, Where do we go? Because I don't really want to go any of these directions. That's cool. That's not cool. Ah, uh, no, you see, the ghost bombs come back. I don't like this. Fuck everything about this. The fuck's going on with your face? They've all got, like, a second face printed over the f top. What the fuck? Why have they all got like a second face printed over? That's really strange, but yet fascinating all at the same time. That's weird, you can see one face. I don't like this at all. What the fuck just happened? Jesus f fucking wet. That would have probably been slightly more effective if I wasn't completely engrossed in the painting. But at the same time, it still worked. Paint deep lies. And we're back with the whispering. Now a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> I'm not that round. Okay. Okay. They're ramping it up a little bit with the the scare factor, so... Big open rooms often mean bad things. The rat ran into the fire. Okay, that was just weird. Rat's saying that's stupid. Why do rats keep running into the fire? And another one. That's three rats that have run into the fire. Oh, do you want me to run into there as well? What the fuck? Oh, 
I knew, I fucking knew that there was going to be something behind me and it still fucking got me. Oh, fuck. How long have we been going? You know what? No, I'm going to stop there. I'm stopping there. I fucking quit. i tell you what. I'll ask you guys this. This has been a very quick look at Layers of Fear. If you want me to carry on, let me know. From my understanding, this game is about four to five hours, depending on how long you take, maybe less, maybe a bit more. If you want to see me play more, let me know, and I'll play more. What the? They're all bleeding from their eyes, and they're hanging. Nice. Okay. I'm going. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed that, because I certainly... Well, don't get me wrong, I did, but I didn't. So yeah, this has been Layers of Fear. You can pick it up on Steam right now. It's pretty cool. So far, I'm liking it. It's it's getting me. I can understand. Some people weren't that impressed by it, because it's a lot of jump scares and things like that, but I'm kind of digging it, so... But, as I say, I'm a bit of a noob when it comes to horror, so there you go. Right, thank you very much for watching, and hopefully I will see you soon. Let me know if you want to see more. Bye-bye. <laughs>